Hello you, welcome back to Advanced Order Reboot Camp. Let's just jump straight back into it. Who are we against again? I think we just unlocked Max, didn't we? We had the choice for the missions. Yes, here we go. Do you want to do Max Strikes as Max or as Andy? Well, seeing as we just unlocked him, I think we should do it as Max. Just for variety's sake. Max's tanks are always grade A, but this particular battle will be won at sea. Okay, what does the flavour text for this one say? Seats ahead are rough and uncertain. Can Andy turn the tide? Unless it means we have to do both, but we're going to do this one. Because in the original Advance Wars, you had um, kind of like branching paths almost, and there were certain secrets that would be unlocked depending on which characters you picked for certain missions, um, and who you picked would determine who would show up in the final battle, etc. And the Sonya missions were optional, and if you beat Kambai within so many days, etc. That sort of thing. Hello there, Max. Nice to see you helping out. Come on. How you doing? Uh, now I'm here, what's the kid gonna do? Yeah. Oh, Max, you haven't changed a bit. Don't get too cocky, and he may be young, but he's already quite a capable commander. If you're not careful, he may just pass you up in the ranks. Do you need a refresher on C units? No. <laughs> Thanks for checking in. I know what's what. Right, you got a handle on that. You need me to explain? Nope, submarines are fine. I can handle Let's go. Okay. Do 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 do. Da ba 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 da ba da. Alright, so he's just got like four battleships. Yeah, Max has got slightly shittier battleships, but this should be fine. Yeah, I'll just I'll just take care of it with the submarines. Cause uh, we're gonna be out of range. Max's submarines are bonkers. Overpowered. In fact, most of his units are bonkers overpowered. Because, if we take a look at his CO screen, Max's direct combat units gain a plus 50 to firepower. His indirect combat range uh, is minus 1, and they also have minus 10% power and defense. But it doesn't matter, just look at. <laughs> plus 50 is insane. They toned him down a lot in Advanced Wars 2, but. Max in Advance Wars 1 is one of the strongest, if not the strongest, commander in the game. It's nuts how broken they made him. Doesn't matter that my indirect units have got minus one range, I'm not going to use them. I'm really not going to bother using them much. They're just not really necessary. <laughs> so this should be over literally within like minutes. I don't imagine this mission will take very long, because just because Max is so strong. So we'll just see what Olaf does now. Behold. Gaze upon my wondrous army! Orange Star may match me in numbers, but it possess only a fraction of my power. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're not very well balanced. What happens if Orange Star sends their subs under? Well, that'd stop your cold. Yes. My battleships rule the sea! Is there anything more that I need? Or cruisers would be helpful, mate. Nothing at all! Attack! 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 <laughs> well, ain't he like a dog with his favourite bone? As long as you're happy, boss. Oh, and he's got his superpower already. This is going to do nothing. <laughs> Just get this over and done with, Olaf. Let him have his fun. Um, as I was saying, in my spare time, I've actually been playing a couple of the War Room maps for this. Just to experiment and see how the AI behaves and things. And it's quite different from what I'm used to, actually. The AI is has been tweaked slightly. It's not as predictable anymore. Which I suppose is a good thing. Ah yes, of course, because of the snow. We'll just dive down, that's fine. Do 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 Ah Concentrating face. Yeah, you can see, you can really see the uh, lower firepower coming in there, but that's okay. So I've got another um, doodah. What should we call it? Um, I don't really want to lose my battleship, but I've got my lander here. If anything, I can probably just go for the HQ if I take out all of his battleships in the next turn or so, which I probably will. I'll probably get my CO power next turn, and he will rue the day he ever met me. Hehe. <laughs> How dare they? Nobody plows through my army like that. 
Hit the back. Ow. 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 Oof. That's fine. I do like the sound effects that the units and the things make, I have to say. I just don't quite know what all of them sound like yet, so, um... It's not going to be as easy to cheese and fog of war as it used to be, because you could just count from the sounds, like, what the AI had. I'll take out his rockets, because they're slightly scary. Hmm. Yeah, this should be fine. I don't see... Um, I can even hit his battleship for a decent amount of damage, but... Yeah, he's going to capture, that's fine. Um, and we'll just do this. We should win in the next turn or two. I imagine. Then I what comes next? It's, um... Max's Folly, I think, comes after this. Or is it Olaf's Navy? I can't remember. One of the two. Say, so it's been a while since I've played Advanced Wars 1. Just going to quit drink. I've got one cup of water for doing this. This may be a mistake for this session. Mm. Oh, yeah, excuse me. Right. Do, 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 do. Yeah, fuck it. Give up. Give up while you still can. Ooh. Very dramatic. Oh, the little punching sound effects. That's quite cute. <laughs> it's like playing punch out or something. Oh, this isn't a terrible remix. But yeah, like, I just annihilate his battleships. There we go. <laughs> Christ. Yeah, I don't hate this, but I don't like it either. Yeah, we'll we'll win on the next turn. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about the Max one. Well, to be fair, I never really liked Max's theme tune anyway. It sounds fine in this remake, but what are we imbeciles doing? Get out there and fight! Um, yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about it. I prefer this version now, so say, like, his one in DS sounded awful, but Max in Dual Strike looks awful. It looked like he'd been taking steroids for the past, like, 50 years. His design in Dual Strike is one of the worst I've ever seen. <laughs> it was horrible. My. But yeah, he's definitely one of my favourite characters, but he's alright to play. He's just incredibly strong. Say like he's overpowered. There we go. How's that? What do you think of that power? Wow. There's no way I could do that much damage. Do yeah, that's right. <laughs> as long as I didn't use my indirect combat units, that is. Uh. You... <laughs> that's exactly right, Andy. Mm -hmm. Max doesn't use indirect combat units because he's clumsy. And your range of fire is small too. That's life-threatening, isn't it? <laughs> hey, sometimes people have that problem. Not a problem for me, but... <laughs> I'll do just fine without relying on those units. I wonder about that. At any rate, excellent work, Max. Now you two work together and try to play nice. You heard the lady. Let's stop fighting and do this, Andy. I think she was talking to you, Max. <laughs> that about wraps it up. Say, I am enjoying the voice acting overall. Some of the casting choices are a little odd, but and they don't sound like how I imagined them, but it's nice to have these characters brought to life, if that makes sense. Only about 10 minutes in and a mission down already, sweet. But yeah, having these characters brought to life... Oh, hi, Hachi. Um, with animations and the voice acting and things and the little sound effects and stuff, it really does... Yeah, it's disappeared now. I don't think we get to do both. Yeah, I like. I just like that these characters are now feel more real. Oh, no. Oh. Let me tell you something, you smart mouth. My apologies, exalted commander. I am at your service. That's better. You just remember your place. Now listen closely. Those units we saw earlier have advanced even further into our territory. This is your chance to redeem yourself, Grit. Do you understand me? Do what needs to be done. 
Right, so I should wait here and... What do you mean, wait? Orange Star troops are advancing! Okay, okay, understood. Would you to call your humble servant Grittle Answer? If I didn't know better, I might think you weren't taking this seriously. Oh yeah, it's this one. Okay. Grit's troops lay low in fog of war, waiting for their shot. Another grit mission. Uh. Hmm. Let's just stick with Max, actually. Yeah, let's do it. Sod it. Stick with Max. We've been playing as uh, Andy for a while, so let's have let's have Max for a bit. He's usually okay because um, say his units are incredibly strong. So let's just see what happens. Ah, it's this one. Yes, I remember this. Our vision is greatly compromised in these conditions. We can see almost nothing. More fog of war. Please tell me you're joking. Hasn't Nell already run you through this? Yeah, I know all this stuff. Goodbye. Let's go and find all the enemy hiding. Oh, hello. There's a little bastard. Give him a little bit of what for. He's probably got missile units, I imagine. I wouldn't be bloody surprised. But... Didn't think his units would be that far forward, but... Uh, oh, shit. Overshot. Yeah, he's got a missile unit. There we go. I knew he had at least one. Couldn't remember where it was, though. Okay. But if that's... Let's find. Let's see if he's got any more hidden here first. But we'll at least move into the minimum range, so he can't strike us down and get going. Right. Let's see what he does. See if we can count his units accurately this time. Okay. There's at least two indirects down there. Tank recon. Alright, I heard at least three tanks, and he's got some indirects down in the south, down there. Down here somewhere, so we'll find them. Ah, there's one. I knew that was down there somewhere, at least. And I imagine... The other one's probably down here. So if we stick to the trees, he won't be able to find us. He's probably got some more hidden further in the back. Like, I imagine he's probably got some down here. And a couple down here. No, there's nothing there. And nothing there. Okay. Give that a bit of a one-two punch then. And see what he does this turn. I'm trying to remember how many units he has. I don't think he's got any anti-air units, though. It's time to take you down. Uh, he's probably going to go for my APC because my rocket it's exposed by his rockets, but I imagine we'll be okay. I don't think it's going to do much damage. Oh! Does he have another missile unit? Shit! Where is that? And how did he see that there? Because there's nothing next to it. What the... F that doesn't seem right to me, but... Hmm... I don't think that should have hit me when it did. But, whatever. <sighs> That's slightly annoying. Where's this other rocket unit then? Is it up here? There's... Yeah, there it is. Okay. Well, that's my medium tank uh, going to be targeted, but... We'll take out his recon at least. He shouldn't be able to see me now. Unless the AI cheats. That's the point. Does the AI cheat and it will be able to hit me through the fog? Because in Advanced Wars 1 and 2 originally... The AI would cheat, but I suppose it must cheat, but how did it know I was there? Because there's nothing to there was nothing next to me for it to hit it with. So I don't know how it hit me up there. I'm gonna have to watch that back. 
Unless I didn't put it in the woods by accident, it's entirely possible. Yeah, is the AI going to cheat? Huh? Is the AI going to cheat? No! The AI can't see me anymore in the fog, that's interesting. So what the bloody hell happened up north? Ah, sod it. Right. The AI doesn't cheat anymore, that's interesting. I think rockets only have a vision range of one as well. Yeah, they do. But I don't know where his artillery went. Do 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 do. Oh, he does have an anti air unit. Balls! I'll have another helicopter anyway, so I can attack this one. Okay. So now we know he can't see me. I should have moved my recon in first in my defense, but never mind. Now we know he can't see me, we can actually move our stuff forward with less fear of the um, AI seeing it from a mile away. Because if the AI can't see, then he's got two. Oh Where goes that plan? Um, yeah, he's got two artillery in the. Um... Yeah, there goes one of my helicopters. Bulls. Yeah, he trapped himself on my recon. The AI can't see me. That's amazing. I was really hoping that they would fix that because it wasn't much fun to fight. If the, you know the AI could see you, but if they can't, then ding, ding, ding. But where does... Does he have... Yeah, he must have an, another indirect or two somewhere. Now there's his other artillery unit, which retreated. What time are we on? We're about almost 20 minutes in. Hmm. Right. Actually, that's the point. We can check the status screen. It should tell us how many units he has. Unless that's the only one he's got left. Let's find out. Because I imagine he's probably got somewhere down here. Intel... Yeah, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. He has a few left. It's just, where are they? So... Yeah. There's one. I imagine the other one is probably in this tree here. No? Huh. Okay. But if they're over here, then there's no way I'm going to get them, so... We'll just sneak in and go for the HQ capture, I suppose. It's a little bit slower, but... Fuck it. I'm beyond any pretenses of um, playing this properly at this point, as you've already probably noticed. Well, I do have a single helicopter, but... Hmm. Pew pew. If he shoots it down... Yeah, okay, he's got another missile unit on our island up north. Bollocks. Oh, that means I can't destroy all his units now. But that's fine, I don't need to. We'll just start capturing his HQ. Yeah, so that... He must have a missile up here somewhere. But I don't, I don't know how it targeted me in the woods, unless I put it here by accident because I'm an idiot and I misclicked. Which is entirely feasible, to be quite honest with you. But... Yeah, okay, at least we know the AI generally doesn't cheat otherwise, though. Which is something? I mean, it's a small consolation, but... Yeah. Right. Can we see if we can spot it up here? No, our vision doesn't quite go that far. That's fine. We win next turn anyway. So let's just speed this turn up a little bit. Oh, he's got an artillery or a rocket or something. Alright, so he's got two or three units in this peninsula which we can't get to, but it doesn't matter. Because we win. Hooray. <laughs> Hey there, Max. It's been a while. Grit, is that you? I was wondering why I hadn't seen you around lately, and now I know why. 
Turns out you're working for Blue Moon. How's that going for you, treacherous piece of... <sighs> oh, Maxie, don't be like that. I got my reasons for doing what I do, you know? But I'm getting out of here before you start getting... <laughs> Before you get started preaching again. See y'all down the road. Hold it right there, Grit. Uh, Dang it. He got away. What's he doing a blue moon? If I remember... If I remember the story correctly, Grit used to be... Yeah, he used to be an orange star commander of any defected for whatever reason. I can't remember why. I would have got a better score there if I hadn't lost one or two more units, which I did. But never mind. We all make mistakes, hence why I was born. Right, moving swiftly on. Hello again, Hatchy. There's some new music in stock. Just coming down to Hatchy Shop when you're ready to do business. I'll do that later. Um, speaking of the voice acting and stuff, actually, I mentioned earlier, someone mentioned to me in the comments section, which I can't believe I didn't pick up on before, that Andy is, Andy is voiced by Ash Ketchum, or at least the original voice actress for Ash from the from the anime, which is interesting. Blast it! Running out of opportunities, and I'm running out of patience. Great. I don't even need to get so worked up. It's not like this land was really Blue Moon's territory to begin with. What did you say? After all my hard work and planning. Oh, come on, man. It's common theft. Let's just call it what it is. You insolent little... Oh, hold on, Chief. Let's not get ill flustered. Don't you think it's time to head out? Like you said, those uh, orange star troops are practically knocking on our door. You are on the thinnest of ice grid. Don't go anywhere. You understand? I'll deal with you when I get back. Blizzard battle. Push back Oles forces and secure 12 cities for Orange Star to win. Ah, it's this one, is it? It's a shame we don't have Sammy to hand right now. Uh, yeah, let's stick with Max for this episode. Call this our final mission for the day. Oh, the little loading icon in the corner's changed. Okay, let's see how we do on this on this one. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm gonna need to get another drink of water. Capture battle. Right, this shouldn't be too hard. Okay. Yeah, it's a uh, it's Ash Ketchum. <laughs> it's a divided deployment region for Olaf. If we can drive him away from the region, we can cut his strength with his forces dramatically. Sounds great. We can finally put an end to this conflict with Olaf. <laughs> That's right. You need to capture as many locations as possible and quick. First damage to secure 12 cities will win. Stay alert and good luck. Okay, let's see what we got here. Basis for deploying troops, check. We're good to go. So we want to capture as many cities as possible. Again, it's a shame we don't have Sammy right now. She would make this a little bit easier, but we'll work with what we've got. And we'll see how we do. Can I... And I don't need any more troops. I mean, I'll just save my money for now. Right. Let's see what Olaf does. I do like this map. If I remember, this mission's quite fun. Yeah. Oh. I've only just noticed. This may be really hard for you to pick up on the video, but I've just noticed that when the units charge forwards, they leave little tire marks in the terrain. Look at that. I don't know how well this is going to pick up for you. It is in 720, so you should be able to see it, but they leave little tire mac indents in the terrain and stuff. The detail on this is gorgeous. I really like that. That's quite cute. Say so the detail and stuff is great, and it, it, the game is... The overhead is growing on me. I don't mind the design of the units. That doesn't bother me. And I like how they look in battle, like the toy soldier appearance and stuff they've got going on. That's fine, that doesn't bother me. It was just the overheads m look of the map, maps plural, I should say, which I wasn't super keen on. And a quick drink, excuse me. But I see what they were going for. Because um, it's supposed to be like um, tabletop, like tabletop games. And I, um, and I can, I can see it, and I don't mind it, I don't hate it, um, as I say, I just wasn't overly keen on it, but it's, it's, it's growing on me. Um, so we'll, oh yeah, we need, we need another tank now. I don't think we need anything else for now. Um... 
Let's see what Olaf does. Okay. It's fine if he captures that city. It's first to 12. We just can't let him take the one at the top. And I actually want to take this one here away from him. If I can. Which I think I should be able to. Right, that'll bait in his medium tank. So... Send these guys up north to take these. I, I, I'm actually going to go get some... Oops, a daisy. I'm actually going to go and get uh, a mech, I think. No, hang on. Build a tank here and... Yeah, an infantry. Okay, that's fine. We'll go for a mech. I need the tanks, really. I'm playing as mechs. So... Yeah, we'll bait in this medium tank. I hope. Is he going to take the bait? Yes, he did. Okay. Oh, he deployed in a river. That's a little irritating, but... We'll make it work. Yeah, I can't let him take that one up north. So, if I take out these ones down here... Ooh! One shot. Nice. Lovely. Uh. Yeah, I'll deploy another infantry over here so we can take this bridge. That's where I'm actually going to send this other tank. And to get those mechs, I can actually slowly march them across the mountains. And also just for technique score and things. Oh, he's going to deploy his bloody superpower. Power, even. Not super. That's fine. Yeah, yeah. You just, just get on with it, mate. He's having his fun, bless him. Excuse me. Right. Uh, okay. Yeah, this turn's not going to be super dangerous. Yeah, I just, I can't let him take that city up north, so... What I'm going to do... Is... Target all of his infantry and open fire! I'm actually going to, um... Move these guys... No, okay, yeah, that's fine. Bring that tank in to charge over the bridge. Take this factory up here. Uh, 9, 10, 11. And if we take we take these two and these two cities and we'll win. Okay, that's all we need to do. Shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> I say. Easier said than done, but... Right. Yeah, I just can't let him capture that one up north, or we will lose. But that's fine. Uh, where did we get to originally? Because, as I mentioned in episode one, we had a very, very old um, Let's Play Advance Wars, the original, which we did when we were back in high school. I'm trying to remember where we got up to in the campaign for that. Um, I think we got decently far, you know. Because I, I remember we got to the Kanbai missions, or Kanbei, or however you want to bloody pronounce it. I've had different people tell me different things. Some people say I pronounce it wrong, some people say I, I pronounce it right. I don't know. I've never heard it said out loud. Maybe we'll hear it spoken out loud during this. Um, but, yeah, but I know we got to the missions against him and Sonya. Did we get to the missions against Drake? Because I think we got at least like two thirds into the campaign before we stopped. So Advance Wars 1's campaign is not very long. Yeah, the main battle at the moment seems to be for this bridge, which is what I expected. The bridge over the River Y. It seems right, so let's just clear up his troops somewhat. Okay, that's fine. I'll just heal that guy up a little bit. March these mechs in slowly. Don't know why he built a rocket unit. It's not going to be much help for him, bless him. Right, okay. Um, Another tank. Why not? All the tanks. I should have built some else in the southern factory. Bollocks. Never mind. He's going to move that artillery into position, or is he going to leave it put? He was smart. Yeah, he moved it in if he was smart, which he did. Okay, that's fine. But I have a mech in the mountains, so that's going to clear up this, which will allow me to bring in this to hit it. So, uh, 
There we go. That wasn't much of a threat anymore, is it? And now we'll be able to take... If I lure that in a little bit... Did he just jump over the bridge? Oh no, it just looks like they leapt over the bridge. Okay. We should win in the next couple of turns. Lovely stuff. Tank. Tank. And an infantry for good measure. Uh, is he going to deploy his power again? No, he's not quite there. Ow. That's okay. That's fine. Oh, now he's got it. Is he going to use it at the end of his turn? The AI does that sometimes. No. Ah. Do I get the increase of movement range as well? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, that's fine. Um. Aha! That's fine. Bring those guys in. Another tank to replace my weakened ones that are becoming more squishy. I'm even going to go for his medium tank with mine, because I can. I don't think we're going to need many more units, but because I've started to lose a few, I'm going to keep building them just for score's sake. Um, yeah, we should win in the next... Well, next turn, actually. I don't think he can stop me. Oh, he's going to do his power, at least, anyway. That's fine. Let him have his fun. The fury of nature. He's enjoying it. That's the main thing. Just like I am, and I hope you are, too. Yeah, we've waited a long time for this, and now it's finally here. I don't foresee him being able to interrupt me. I don't think he can. Yeah, he can't interrupt me. Good stuff. We win. Yeah. I'm just going to uh, build some things. Building artillery is max. The most big brain of moves. Uh. <laughs> oh, have you never built artillery as max before? It's a, it's tactical brilliance is what it is. <laughs> okay, no, I can't. I can't claim that. I know it's stupid. <laughs> right, let's just capture this and win. Yay! Jobs are good then. Not again. He will not be pleased with me if this losing streak continues. Who's he, Olaf? I mean, I know, but... Spoilers for those of you who've never played this before. Grits, where are you? Uh -huh. Yep. Yeah. Get out there and stop that cursed Orange Star army. Yeah. Easy said than done, boss. You didn't leave me anything to work with. <sighs> Don't get saucy. Just rally the troops and do something. I must go and pay him my respects. I'll return later. Do not fail me, Grit. Okay. Well, Olaf just tucked his tail between his legs and ran away. Where does that leave me? I guess I'll mosey on down and clean up his mess. Again. Yay! Got it. You sure did, Max! Cheers for popping by. Yay! Lovely stuff. I wonder if rivals are still in the game. That's a good point. I'm hoping not. I've just remembered that mission exists. Because we were talking about secrets and things earlier and I've just unlocked a hidden memory that that mission actually exists at the end of the campaign if you make certain choices. I'm hoping it doesn't. Yep, we're going down south now. No sign of Olaf. Looks like we're facing off against Grit next. Grit. Is he the guy who keeps calling me Junior? Do you know him or something? Yeah, you could say that. Grit and Elle and I used to be friends. He was always a tough one to figure out, but this Blue Moon stuff... Oh, right. I forgot Nell said we used to be friends. Why is he working for Blue Moon? That's something I'd like to ask him myself. That's why I should take the lead this time. Let me handle Grit, Andy. History lesson. Old friends clash on the battlefield and old wounds are revealed. Well, seeing as we're about half an hour in and I don't want this mission... This mission... This episode to, um, to go on for, like an hour again. I'm going to call it there. 
we'll pick up next time and see where this takes us. Cheers for joining me today on another episode of Advance Wars Reboot Camp. I've been Shiki, you have been awesome. Take care of yourself, like the video if you did, subscribe for more upcoming installments in this campaign as we play through, and I'll see you then. Cheers for watching, stay safe, and ta -ra.